Hey, what's up guys, Lino here, and it's that time of year when all kids and teens go out and accept free candy from strangers. So I thought to myself, hey, I trick-or-treated in the past, and while I only got one Snicker bar every year, I went to trick-or-treat. So, uh, I thought I should give you tips, guys. So, this is how to get the most candy on Halloween. So the first tip is to actually wear a good costume. Most trick-or-treaters go as ghosts, vampires, or zombies. Instead, you should go as something as no one knows. That's right, a script error. Anyway, I'm just playing around. You should go as something that's actually a nice costume so that people can give you lots of diabetes. I mean candy. Tip quattro. As you can see, I'm in Spanish class and quattro means two. So get it right. Anyway, uh, tip quattro is when you see those uh, balls that says grab one. Uh, to be honest, guys, you should just be generous and fair and only grab one so that all the kids, when they see those candy balls, can also grab one. But when no one is looking, grab the whole candy and even the ball. Tip number three is when you say trick or treat to the uh, house owners or the person giving out the candy, say it in a really nice and sweet voice. Would you rather give uh, candy to a voice that says, oh trick or treat, <laughs> or like, uh, like or a guy who says, or a girl, not assuming genders, that says, trick or treat. Uh, make sure you comment down below, I'm just playing guys, but on the real here, if I was passing out candy, I would pass it out to the kids who have very nice voices, because voices are everything. My fourth tip is to bring a big pillowcase. When owners or the uh, person or whatever passing out candy, whatever, see a kid or a teen holding a big pillowcase, usually to those kids who have those small pumpkin baskets, they usually give a... Uh, more candy to the kid with the pillowcase because bigger is better, haha, <laughs> winky face. Anyway, and well, you should trust me just because it has more space and well, uh, it gets you more candy. So more candy equals more diabetes and more diabetes equals closer to your death. So yeah. Finally, last tip is just to be safe overall. Although this might, t this tip might not be able to get you more candy, it will for sure, uh, get you, uh, well, let you keep the candy you have. Just make sure you have friends around, bring flashlights, and know your curfew because you don't want to die or get kidnapped by some clown or Pennywise. Instead, go home, eat the candy, and gain 10 pounds so that you won't get kidnapped, but make sure you have parents or friends around so, yeah, you don't get killed. And that's it for the video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you can, drop a like, subscribe if you are new here, and share this video with your friends or uh, siblings so they can get the most candy on Halloween. I know this is a different type of video I recorded and I usually just do the Overwatch content videos but honestly, I thought it would be fun to uh, give you guys tips to get the most candy. Anyway guys, thank you for watching this video and it's been Lino <laughs> and I love you all. Peace.